we have put in so much entitlement into our government that we really have spoiled our citizenry and said, you don't want the jobs that are available. A room full of the hopeful unemployed came to a morning job fair. They gave resumes by the thousands. How would you have voted on that bill to extend unemployment benefits? I would have voted no because the truth about it is is that they keep extending these unemployment biz benefits to the point where people are afraid to go out and get a job. Thousands of people stood in line today at John Esquaga's Nugget where the Legends at Sparks Marina is holding a job fair. You don't want the jobs that are available. I'll take what I can get. You know, right now times are hard for everybody. We really have spoiled our citizenry. These people just can't find a job, and many are out of unemployment insurance benefits. I thought this is for poor people, you know, but all of a sudden now I'm poor. I thought it would never happen to me, but now it has, and uh, it's very humbling. We really have spoiled our citizenry. People lose their job through no fault of their own, as many have during this recession. Mm -hmm. Sharon Angle's solution is to cut their unemployment benefits so low so they're somehow going to go out and find jobs that don't exist. How does that make any sense? There are jobs that do exist. That's what we're saying is that there are jobs. As your U.S. Senator, I'm not in the business of creating jobs. People ask me, what are you going to do to develop jobs in your state? Well, that's not my job as a U.S. Senator to bring industry to this state.